to walk as fast as you can to the exit. And not only am I any other, I don't know. Yeah, you just meant to walk as fast According as you can. According to the text, the door. Only be There's no trick to it. Kugna, Fanu Naemna, but Gliz Kafungin, Kathava Hell, Kulth Kathulu Kafungni, I a Raiga Zengaro, I a Hydra. No trick, just walk faster. Apparently, even though the last three times I've been walking continuously, just walk faster. And not only that. You have to do it perfectly to get out. Says the walkthrough. So here we go, we're walking. Yeah, we're walking. And you just have to walk as fast as you can. Fast enough. What does that do? Should I take some morphine? I'm not injured in any way. You really are just supposed to walk as fast as you can. According to the text, the doors can only be opened with an Behuin and Kugna, Fanu Naemna, but Gliz Kafungin, Kathava Hell, Kulth Cthulhu Kafungni, I a Raiga Zengaro, I a Hydra. This game is just so bad. No, no, that's not fair. That's not fair. It's only... It's only... It's only a few key moments of really, really bad. The morphine does not help you run faster. Although it makes you go a little bit crazy.
amazing. Amazing. Wolfine. the end of the game. The cyborg raptors, I think, were helping us. This is their city, apparently. In fact, I might be looking through their eyes. I think I am. Yep. Yep, I am. Jack. Yes. Why have you summoned me? They're the yes. There is something I must show you. We must hurry. Time is short. Okay. Where are we going? The Great Library. Let's go. A terrible conflict is upon us, and our hosts will not survive it. The keenest minds are already projecting to later days. Who will be the enemy? There have been no ructions with either the Migo in the north or Cthulhu's kin to the south. In your wanderings, did you come upon the past seal trapdoors at the foundation of the old city? Yes, but I didn't understand their purpose. There was a terrible war between us and a race of half polypus creatures that had been dominant until our arrival. Understand. This volume tells of that bloody period. Are you going to read it to us? Why are you showing me this now? They are still down there, Jack. Thriving in the darkness. They are plotting. Fighting to break free of their bonds and wreak a terrible revenge. Okay. The end is inevitable. And close. Very close. How much time do we have? What the hell was that? You are no longer safe. Follow me. This is strange. This is... I don't understand. Are we setting up for a sequel? I think we are. Hi, Jack. <laughs> don't do that. You've got so much to live for. Right. <laughs> and... 
what does it say? I can't read the handwriting. Dark corners of the earth. That's what I can. I should walk in the shadows between world. Blah blah blah. Dark corners of the earth. Whatever. And that's the game, I believe. Mr. No, Walters. No, there's more. Mr. Walters. Wow. Wow. Can there's you more. hear me, Mr. Walters? Him. Am I supposed to move? Am I supposed to... Oh, gone. What was that? Suicide note. February 16th. Now at my end I can fully see. My last case opened in me a new fear. A real fear. A fear of myself. Of what I am and of what I have always been. All that I was is now lost. What? Hope, purpose, pleasure, or meaningless. I now walk in the shadows between worlds. And it is there I have finally glimpsed upon what lives in the dark corners of the earth. Okay. <laughs> rank D. Yeah. Yeah, you know why I got rank D? Because your game is full of bugs and bad design, that's why I have rank D. I'm clinically insane. I don't even... No. No. No, I'm not doing it. Alright, so that's the game. Um, I'm gonna put the credits in a different video because the volume was different and all that anyway. Yeah, I don't... I don't really have anything else to add. Like, overall, it's, it's a moderately good game. Like, there are moments of brilliance very few moments of brilliance. A few more moments that are just really bad. One game breaking bug. And then towards the end of the game the puzzles just make no sense. Like there's no way that the game gives you no clues at all. And the doors will glitch out and you open the door or you know you, anything. You activate it a few, the first few times it doesn't work. You activate it again it works. It's just you know, mechanics are bad, the save points are poorly placed. It is, the story is kind of interesting. I mean, the, the characters are, are kind of interesting. In fact, it, it's quite good. You know, compared to the average game, I would think the story is kind of pretty good. The combat is okay. I mean, uh, you, it's not meant to be a shooter anyway, but it is tolerable, the gunshots and all that. The madness and the fatigue and the injuries is... That, that's perfectly manageable. It, it suits the game, it's our survival horror. But it's just some of the puzzles and some of the save points are just really... They just need a bit more work, you know? They just need to... Need someone to go back, look at them again, and just fix them. Fix them because they're broken. It, the, the, the story is, is quite good. I'm quite entertained by it. And you know, the tone of my voice now sounds like I'm quite angry and... and you know, sometimes a few bad things just ruin the, ruins the whole experience and that's just really unfortunate, I think. I think if you just polish away a few of those really bad bits, this would have been a, a fairly decent game. But it, you know, just... A few bad moments puts you in a bad mood. That's all. Alright, I'm gonna end it here and... Yeah. Yeah, if you... If you think about game design, then maybe you should learn a few things from this. A few things what not to do. Alright, I'll see you guys later. I, I wouldn't recommend this game and that's a real shame because... The story is really good and there's a few moments of it that are quite good. If, if you, yeah, well, if you go into it knowing that there's a few game-breaking bugs and you're, and you're okay with looking at guides on the internet when the game just isn't completely, when it's just completely illogical, then, okay, go for it, you know, try it out. But just know there are a few problems with this thing. That's all. Okay.
see you guys in the next game or series of videos or whatever it is I do. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it. Huh. It's, it's okay, mixed. Mixed experience, I say. See you later.